Welcome to Bears and Exhale. Today is Wednesday, May the 16th, and this is the market overview looking at uh, everything that we look at uh, each and every night. Um, <clears throat> another down day. Um, <laughs> right, broken record, right? I mean, every day is a down day. Um, this time, a gravestone doji potential reversal signal, and uh, we can see how all the uh, other reversal signals have worked out, so uh, why should we think that this one is any different? Well, you know, maybe we shouldn't. It's, uh, well, it's coming in at this previous low, almost, uh, definitely into the shadow of it. Uh, maybe that's something. Uh, beyond that, 14-day RSI moving average sticking down, stochastics down, CCI up, RSI down, histogram down, MACD down. Overall, pretty darn ugly little chart still. And uh, what is there to say beyond that? Well, uh, we had positive divergence in the uh, MACD histogram that was broken today in the daily. 60-minute um, time frame, anything to look at? 14-day uh, RSI moving average starting to try to turn around. Stochastic's very low. CCI down, RSI sideways. And uh, more positive divergence on the MACD histogram maintaining the positive divergence in the uh, RSI and uh, very eh, it's, eh, it's I'm just going to call it broken in the uh, stochastic and uh, maintaining it with the uh, CCI so more of the same except that uh, now things are a little more developed and at some point it's going to matter SPX more of the same uh, not a gravestone doji, but an inverse hammer. And uh, is it at a level to be caught? Nope, it's not. So, um, just waiting for that to, to decide to uh, reverse itself. Uh, the VIX, and uh, oh, and one thing that I think is uh, interesting is uh, you know, the, the real bodies of the uh, uh, decline are less today. So maybe it's slowing down to the downside, but um, SPX not as much. But uh, nonetheless, maybe it's uh, losing some momentum. Um, VIX, the VIX, another fat body spinning top. Um, no downtick, obviously. And we had uh, peaked above this previous high, closed above it today. Mm. If we've got this one over here in the mid-23, maybe uh, maybe it's going to go that high. Who knows? 14-day um, RSI moving average moving up along with the stochastics. Uh, CCI trying to work itself off a little bit up on the RSI, up on the histogram, up on the MACD. We have no downtick. We have no uh, really good signs of a reversal, so it's all up to the news. 60 minute time frame. 14 day RSI moving average, trying to roll over. That's something. Stochastic says still moving up. CCI down, RSI down, histogram sloping down. Maybe uh, maybe that'll be enough. But uh, still a long shot until it actually gets underway. Um, I'm just surprised that it has gone on so long uh, with nothing for the uh, bulls. Uh, just amazing. Maintaining and further developing the negative divergence in the 60-minute time frame for the VIX. At some point it's going to matter, and it just doesn't matter yet. XOR. Slightly lower. Yeah, not, not like uh, the rest of this decline, so is this losing steam? Maybe. We don't have an uptick on MACD histogram yet. Uh, it does appear to be slowing down slightly. Fortune day RSI moving average taking down stochastics down. CCI up, RSI down. MACD down. What is there to say? TNA. Very interesting. Uh, it is at the 200 day moving average. Hasn't done that in a very long time. Past few times, it's had a strong reaction. Is this time uh, going to be the same? I guess it's as good as mine. 14 day RSI moving average ticking down. Stochastics down. CCI sideways down on the RSI, down on the histogram, down on the MACD. 60 minute time frame looking for anything that might be of use. 14-day RSI moving average starting to curl up. Stochastic still pointing down. The fast trying to get a curl. 
curling on the CCI RSI ticking up histogram still slanting down positive divergence positive divergence positive divergence positive divergence at some point it's going to matter UUP this one is absolutely crazy I mean look at this um, pushing the upper Bollinger Band right on up didn't close outside of it so uh, don't have a um, a trick there 14 day RSI moving average ticking up stochastic up CCI down slightly up on the RSI up on the histogram up on the MACD look how high that RSI is that's uh, pretty darn extended um, FXE yep it looks right spinning top um, down on everything except the CCI and just for fun do we have positive divergence in this keeps making new lows um, MACD histogram yes RSI yes stochastics no been busted out as of today um, and CCI yes GLD this one has been falling like crazy too and today is a doji star nothing like uh, last couple of days anyway um, 14 hours I'm moving average ticking down stochastics down RSI down CCI up very slightly on the MACD histogram MACD itself ticking down sure looks like it's at a point where you know maybe maybe it could uh, do something with itself and it is very close and actually touched the uh, same level as this uh, other major previous low. XLF, the financials, ooh, bearish engulfing and um, totally busting out this previous low, terrible sign, and everything pointing down except the CCI. Absolutely awful. That is definitely uh, not a good sign for the bulls. Um, Apple. Yeah, it, uh, it had broken the uh, floor yesterday and continues down, sitting on the lower Bollinger Band. And everything is ticking down except the RSI, going sideways. Now this one in the 60 minute time frame doesn't look bad and that should give some hope to the bulls um, 14 day RSI moving average curling over for a move upward stochastics doing the same CCI pointing up RSI pointing up histogram ticking up and the MACD still pointing down much much better in the 60 minute time frame than uh, just about everything so uh, this can uh, sink the market well it can uh, it can bring it up too so uh, who knows if that's just a test of the uh, previous low that was broken or not, but uh, if it can get through that level, that's going to be really helpful. JP Morgan. Mm. Tried to get back above the 200-day moving average and fell right back through it. You can see the excessive separation. Doesn't matter. We don't have an uptick yet and everything pointing down except for the CCI mm. very very poor um, what else I think that's going to be about it I mean there's nothing really to say until we get an uptick until we get some kind of a bounce and then we evaluate the strength of it and the potential of it um, that's about it um, I'm surprised it is going this long, but uh, it is what it is. As always, all investing decisions are your own. This is a video for entertainment, educational, and consumption of time purposes only. Thank you.